Tsunamis are giant waves that are produced when a large volume of water is displaced in an ocean or large lake by an earthquake. Volcanic eruption, underwater landslide or meteorite. Between 1998 to 2017, tsunamis caused more than 250,000 deaths globally, including more than 227,000 deaths due to the Indian Ocean. Tsunami in 2004. Tsunamis can travel thousands of kilometers with speeds up to 800 kilometers per hour. Once they reach the coast, they can have devastating impacts on the community. Successive crests can arrive at intervals of every 10 to 45 minutes and wreak destruction for several hours. More than 700 million people live in low-lying coastal areas and small island developing states exposed to extreme sea level events including tsunamis, resilient infrastructure, early warning systems, and education is critical to saving people and protecting their assets against tsunami risk in the future. Drowning is the most significant cause of death due to tsunamis. Injuries from debris account for many of the health care needs in the immediate aftermath of the disaster. Falling structures and waters full of swirling debris can inflict crush injuries, fractures, and a variety of open and closed wounds. The risk of communicable diseases depends on the size, health status and living conditions of the population displaced by the tsunami. The population could be at risk of waterborne diseases and respiratory diseases due to crowding in temporary shelters and inadequate water and sanitation, as well as vaccine preventable diseases if there is a low vaccination coverage rate prior to the disaster. Survivors of tsunamis often also face short and long term mental health effects due to loss of family, property, livestock, or crops. The immediate health concerns after the rescue of survivors following a natural disaster are drinking water, food, shelter and medical care for injuries. On December 26, 2004, an earthquake off the coast of Sumatra, Indonesia, brought waves of up to 100 feet to coastal communities in the region, resulting in the deaths of over 200,000 people in 14 countries making it one of the deadliest disasters in recorded history. On March 11, 2011, an earthquake off the coast of Tohoku, Japan, caused tsunami waves that reached 6 miles inland and 133 feet above sea level, resulting in the deaths of over 16,000 people and billions of dollars in damage to infrastructure, including major damage to the Fukushima nuclear power plant. The World Bank estimated it to be the costliest natural disaster in world history. According to the UN, 58 tsunamis claimed more than 260,000 lives, or an average of 4,600 per disaster in the last century, surpassing any other natural hazard. By the end of this decade, 50% of the world's population will live in coastal areas exposed to flooding, storms, and tsunamis. Having plans and policies to reduce tsunami impacts helps build resilience and protect communities most at risk. NASA's expertise and access to Earth-observing data are a valuable tool to help understand the mechanisms behind tsunamis and mitigate their risk to society. Reducing evacuation start time is the most critical variable in saving lives when a tsunami is imminent, and rapid access to accurate and easy to understand information will equip local and regional leaders to order critical oh, life-saving evacuations as quickly as possible that is why nasa actively supports research to understand tsunami hazards and modernize local tsunami forecasting and early warning system
ほどの津波、漂流船舶3隻、人が乗っている模様、外洋から入港する船を見た場合、絶対に入港させるな、どうぞ。気仙沼はいはい現在石巻港内一万見集落えー、多数の車両が岸壁から流れ出す模様はいえー、変わったって津波が大きいです、うんあちょっとこちらでは確認できません現在もう石の気仙沼の構内は水浸しです多数の車両が流れ出しておりますはいはいはいはいすごいわああ戻されてるよくねすごい<笑>あーワイヤーあー綺麗だ。フェリーもダメだね。
ってあれマグロ船があっちに行ったあれ家流されたあれあっちも入ってるあれあーいやーあダメだダメだ